Hey guys, Jonathan here from TechMajesty.com. Before I start, I'd like you to please like the video and subscribe to our channel because it really helps us out. I'll be showing you how to unlock your Sprint iPhone XS and XS Max. The phone was just released today and I'll be showing you how to unlock it through this easy step-by-step -step process. Now I'm showing you this on the iPhone XS but it will work on all other Sprint iPhone models including the iPhone XS Max and any new upcoming iPhone models as well. Our Sprint iPhone Unlock will unlock any Sprint iPhone regardless of any outstanding balances, contracts, financing, blacklist status, etc. What makes our Sprint iPhone Unlock unique is the ability for the phone to be used both domestically in the US and internationally with any GSM carrier. What that means is that once we unlock your Sprint iPhone, you can use it with any GSM carrier in the US. For example, AT&T, T-Mobile, MetroPCS, Simple Mobile, Cricket, etc can all be used on your Sprint iPhone once we unlock it. Besides being able to use the phone in the US, you can use it with any GSM carrier of your choice worldwide as well. The unlock will not affect your warranty, it will increase the resale value of your phone and you will be able to use the phone with any GSM carrier of your choice. To unlock the phone, you will need your computer, it can be a Mac or PC, the latest version of iTunes, a non-allowed SIM card, which is basically a SIM that is not from your original carrier and a USB cable. If you do not have a non-allowed SIM card, later on in the video I'll show you how to unlock the phone using no SIM card at all. Now that we have all that ready, let's begin. The first thing we will need is the 15 digit IMEI number of the phone which we can get by going to the dialer of the phone and dialing star pound zero six pound. This will give you the 15 digit IMEI. So, now that we have the IMEI number of the iPhone, we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will place an order to unlock our iPhone. We will choose the iPhone XS since that's the phone we're unlocking today. Then, for the carrier option, you will choose the carrier your iPhone is locked to, such as AT&T, T-Mobile, MetroPCS, Sprint, Xfinity Mobile, etc. My phone is locked to Sprint, so that's the carrier I'll be choosing. Then, you will enter the 15-digit IMEI number that we got in the beginning of the video. After that, you will click on the Add to Cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you will receive an email within the stated time frame informing you that your iPhone has been unlocked. The email will look like this and say Order Enclosed, and will let you know that your iPhone has been successfully unlocked, and it will include instructions on how to complete the unlock. We will be using the first method and unlocking the phone using iTunes and a non-allowed SIM card. Now if you don't have a non-allowed SIM, or any SIM card for that matter, then you can simply restore the iPhone as a new phone through iTunes to complete the unlock as well. Make sure you do not restore it just from the backup because in order for the unlock process to be completed, the phone must be restored as a new iPhone. You can then later restore from backup or from the iCloud to get your data back. So go ahead and grab your iPhone and insert the non-allowed SIM into the phone. My phone is locked to Sprint, but I would like to use AT&T, so I'm inserting my AT&T SIM into this iPhone. Here's the AT&T SIM card. Once the SIM card is inserted into the phone, grab the USB cable connect one end to the computer and the other end into the iPhone. Now that we have the iPhone connected to the computer, open up iTunes and wait for iTunes to detect the iPhone. Once iTunes detects the iPhone, you'll get the following message saying congratulations, your iPhone has been unlocked. So that's it, the phone is now permanently factory unlocked and you can restore upgrade or do anything else to the phone and the phone will remain unlocked. As you can see, AT&T is listed at the top left hand corner of the screen, so that means the unlock worked perfectly. So guys, it's as simple as that to unlock your iPhone and to start using it with any GSM carrier of your choice in the US or internationally. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if this video helped you. Thank you so much for watching.